Oh my god, this is this is so crazy. I, I should talk, I should talk, I should speak. Okay, I'm actually recording myself this video. This is the first time I think I yeah, I guess. Uh okay, let's talk some stuff, bro. I got a uh, new helmet, which is here as a riding partner for myself and um, mm, why am i recording this video uh, this is not any technical review or something like that and i don't recommend people to buy this thing you know just to sake whether it's premium or something like whatever the reasons might be looks or aesthetics whatever but the thing is i just want to share my experience and record those incidents and let the public to watch and decide whether they want to have or not i don't know if you guys have been following this channel or maybe i mean considering my subscribers count uh, probably all of uh, you are new to this channel only my own incidents with you know connected to helmet especially i'll share those things and uh, real incidents and uh, and uh, i'll i'll let you decide whether you should own a decent helmet for yourself or just go with a basic normal cheaper helmets uh, something like that you know yeah this is the helmet that uh, i was using i'm actually using this uh, currently as well uh, this serves the purpose uh, there's no complaint about it you know uh, with uh, comparison of its cost and uh, price point i just have to quickly tell uh, a story about owning these kind of helmets you know recently uh, i i just i mean i met uh, with uh, a small accident uh, it was not a major thing but yeah it's a small incident uh, uh, twice actually and what happened was uh, i was not you know a rush or something like that i, I was just uh, going with a normal minimal speed around 40 to 50 but i was wearing this helmet guess what when I met with the accident, I just, uh, I hit my head with the ground as confident as if this gonna stick to my head. The moment I hit the ground, you know, my head hits the ground, the helmet just came out of my head, just, just like that. I don't know, I, I always wear the helmet very perfectly, this, you know, pin locker. It's, it's not you know safer i i would I, I can instantly say this is not a safer side i i even i didn't even expect that and i'm i i've been actually searching for you know to own uh, a decent a premium quality helmet uh, i own a uh, i mean basically 150 above cc bike so uh, it definitely needs uh, a kind of a stable and uh, solid helmet you know like uh, but yeah uh, keeping that in my mind i have been searching for it and i i listed on some of uh, some of the brands like axa and uh, steelbird and mt as well uh, and smk finally i own an expulse uh, so aesthetically also it, it should match keeping that in my mind i decided uh, to go with the uh, off-road helmet so that's why I got this SMK helmet. Before that, let's unbox. Okay. Yeah, this is what I got in the box. Just helmet, no visor. I got some some, some documents and a keychain and a locker, which is to tighten the. This is this is the product, which merely this thing costed around uh, five thousand. Yeah, I expected uh, they'll at least provide bar clover and. Uh, some stock visors something like that but none of them are included and it also has uh, double d rings which is 
quite safer if you ask my this looks cool the size of it is around 62 excel it actually required some visor uh, since it's an off-road uh, helmet it doesn't have a stock visor i need to get extra i mean like visor off-road visor which will further cost around uh, 1500 uh, rupees uh, i think these are mx uh, goggles uh, i got these uh, from uh, insta it's called uh, garage 08 uh, so we can see this so which cost around 1500 this is how all together it looks like nice my riding experience is smk altera off-road helmet this is so insanely smooth i don't know uh, smooth is the right word or not but super comfort and uh, i don't say i don't feel any like you uh, know head pain and all even if i ride above 70 80 i don't feel any uh, kind of pain head pain and all yeah it's uh, going well 